To the town of our free road, a stranger one fine day. Hardly spoke to folks around him, didn't have too much to say. No one dared to ask his business, no one dared to make a slip. The stranger there among them had a big iron on his hip, big iron on his hip. It was early in the morning when he rode into the town. He came riding from the south side, slowly looking all around. He's an outlaw, loose and running, came the whisper from each lip. And he's here to do some business with a big iron on his hip. Okay, it's the first morning of Grandpa's sheep hunt. We're out here at first light. Grandpa, what do you think? I think these sheep are crazy. Living. Anybody that client want to be on top of one of them ledges or halfway in between? Don't make sense. Grandpa, we just seen our first ram of the trip. First sheep of the trip. What do you think? Amy wouldn't let me shoot. A Amy described it as it was the two point of sheep. It was a baby. <laughs> well, it wasn't that much of a baby. It might have been a small four point. <laughs> it's clear up in that stuff. There was a ram, a ewe, and a lamb. But it was pretty neat. First sheep that probably most of us have ever seen. Yeah. yeah. I guess out hunting, the first sheep that we've seen. But the outlaw didn't worry, men that tried before were day. Twenty men had tried to take him, twenty men had made a slip. Twenty-one would be the ranger with the big iron on his hip, big iron on his hip. The morning passed so quickly it was time for them to meet. It was twenty past eleven when they walked out in the street. Folks were watching from the windows, everybody held their breath. They knew this handsome ranger was about to meet his death. About to meet his Grandpa, death. Give us a recap of what's happened so far and what the game plan is for this morning. Well, we've seen a lot of, a lot of buffalo. <laughs> <laughs> but no big ones. And them rams are just elusive. But we're ready to go. We're gonna go get one today. It's five o'clock in the morning. Amy's a little tense. <laughs> Other than that, life is good. I like it. He woke up this morning in a bed roll on the ground. Lit a match and built a fire and pulled his steps and down. And he don't mind the cold air when the leaves begin to change. If he could choose, he'd stay forever out on the mountain range. And he sings, ooh, ooh, ooh. mountains got a hold on me and they're not letting go. His friends have always told him to get a job in town Cause cowboy life ain't freedom, boy you're nowhere bound He climbs up in the saddle, rides on through the pain Thanks the good Lord each day that he still holds the reins And he sings, ooh, 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 ooh. mountains got a hold Cowboy. 
Hands on his face show the miles that he's rolled Lonely and cold at night he feels right at home Singing ooh, ooh, ooh. Mountains got a hold on me and they're not letting go There's a crashed, I guess it's a truck. I think the truck bed's right there. Oh, Amy, lift that up and <gasps> at first I thought it was like a great big water catch for a squirrel. Oh. <laughs> so we get back to the truck and there's stuff scattered all over. And we think a raccoon or something came and ripped through all this stuff. Everything that was in the back of this truck is just ripped open. It was weird. Jerky everything. <laughs> Jerky on the on the dirt and They like the chips.
Is everyone good? Okay. Stand the broadside right there looking at us. Yeah, is everyone good? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to take you off so you can get it. You want to take the glove off? No. Nope. Shoot. Got the one? Yeah. That's one. Do we want to shoot now? You feel good. Okay, get back on him. You hit him, but get back on him. I see, I zoomed it out. Brett, right, he's going down, he's going down. Is he going down right there? No, nope, he's right there. What one am? Okay, I'm zooming out. He went to the right of that black rock. Where did he hit on that last one? You broke, you broke the front shoulder, his like front right shoulder's there. toes. Okay, but once you're ready, shoot Just wait these butts to you. Just hang on the ground. All right, right there now. There you go. Oh, I think he's going to go. He's going down. He's right? gone. Yeah. You don't want to shoot him again if you don't have to. I think he's going to lay down right there and die. He's going down right there. Yeah. Do you think we need to shoot again? I would. It looks like a low shot. Yeah, I'd maybe. Maybe aim just a hair higher on him. That's it, probably more. <laughs> He's laid down. So you can't guess. find him now. I think he's laid down, Garth. To the right of the black rock and up a little. Yeah, maybe what he Now he went behind the big rock. Little tiny ridge right here. There's kind of a little ravine. He kind of just barely, just barely got down into that. But it's, but it's down for sure. How do you feel, Grandpa? <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you just got your desert bighorn sheep. Your once in a lifetime is down. Well, I hope we didn't hurt the horns. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Almost to him. Grandpa's going up to get the sheep he just shot. We're just about there. <laughs> yeah. I'm pumped. <laughs> Did 
start. What do you think? That's awesome, Grandpa. Right here's where the bullet came in or out, right there. That had to be an exit. What do you think, Grandpa? It's a good one. It's got to be right. See if you can pull his head out. Oh man, Whoa. Grandpa! <laughs> but they are broomed at the bottom. That's a heck of a ram. I think he'll wow. make a good mount. He's got a sore nose. For it. <laughs> that could be nine right there. Here, Meyer. Let me do that for a second. Yeah. Check him out. <laughs> Try not to fall down the cliff. Oh We're all right. Grandpa. Holy cow. Looks like it's all broke up, huh? <laughs> oh my gosh. I had good guides is all I can tell you. Look at that. Thing. Good guides. Congrats. Congrats. Wow. Oh man. That is so cool. Yeah. Oh, wow, what a what a freaking beautiful ram. Look at that big Roman nose. Cow oh, awesome. yeah. right there. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's swollen from bit the bumped on the nose. <laughs> when we got dad's skin, he had a bunch of fractures. Mm -hmm. He had like a bunch of cartilage and old like crazy. You get them that old and they start start getting busted noses. <laughs> Day Gus McCray. He's a hitching post politician. Spends his time roping grizzly bears and giving pretty girls riding lessons. He's a living bronc busting legend. Folks talk about him near and far. Sundown, he's spurring that old truck over to the million dollar cowboy bar. Where he throws down the whiskey and tells Democrat jokes to hippies. And giving out of town his bad advice and showing off his scars. And people say he's getting older, but his glory days ain't over. And he's still dancing with the ladies, breaking them hearts at the million dollar cowboy bar. If you ever meet him, trust me, you dang sure won't forget him. World champ BS, world class stretcher of outdoor expeditions. When they shut it down, it takes three cowboys to pry him and that stool apart. Every night they drag him, kicking and screaming from the million dollar cowboy bar. Where he throws. And tells Democrat jokes to hippies Giving out of town his bad advice And showing off his scars And people say he's getting older But his glory days ain't over And he's still dancing with the ladies Breaking them hearts at the million dollar cowboy bar He won't be around forever and we'll miss him when he's gone But I'll sit right here listening And grinning just as long as he can still throw down the whiskey And tell Democrat jokes to hippies And give out of town his bad advice And show off all his scars and People say he's getting older But his glory days ain't and he's still dancing with the ladies Breaking them hearts at the million dollar cowboy bar And his name will live on long after he's 
is gone At the million dollar cowboy bar 